I'm Laura. Hi, I'm Zach. Hi, I'm Austin. Hi, I'm Purple. <laughs> start over, start over. Okay. Hi, I'm Laura. Hi, I'm Zach. Hi, I'm Austin. Hi, I'm Parker. We're the Big Ed Show Scientists. Parker, do you want to tell them what we're gonna make today? So we're make, so we're planning to make snow candy. Who wants to tell what book we got this idea from? Um, oh. we got it from Little House in Big Woods. By okay. Laura Ingalls Wilder that we just yeah. finished reading. Okay, and we just had a huge snowstorm. We're gonna use this fresh snow to make our candy. First, before we start making the candy, yeah. I wanted to show use these models to, yes. to teach a little bit about the chemical process that happens we when you're making these. candy. And the caramelization process. Okay, so I have a couple molecules for everyone to hold. Austin, these are yours. Ooh. Okay, so in our models, this isn't exactly what a molecule looks like up close, but it's a model because it represents the atoms and the structure of molecules. So the red is oxygen, the black is carbon, carbon, and the white is like water, hydrogen. Hydrogen, exactly. And the gray is that's all. <laughs> Parker, oh, you're talking too much. <laughs> <laughs> so. I'm gonna bring my bigger molecules out. Yes. We have. Yeah, it, it's like a blast. You keep interrupting me. You have to stop interrupting me, okay? Yes. Because I can't teach anything. We're never gonna make our candy. Mm. Okay. Mm. <laughs> okay. Yes, so, I can leave that part. Interrupted oh, again. Sorry. <laughs> okay, you guys. So. That's that distract. You're interrupting me again. That's totally distracting. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right, so I have these molecules that represent different sugars. Do you guys see the ring pattern in there? Uh, sure. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. You can see the uh, ring. Sure. sure. See, sure. here's a five ring or four carbons and one oxygen, and here's a oh, ring of six goodness. with five carbons and one oxygen. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is a glucose molecule. This is a fructose molecule. Put these together like that. That's a sucrose molecule, and that's what we're using today. That is table sugar, is sucrose. Okay. So I want you guys to throw your water molecules on here because there's a little bit of water in the molasses we're using today. Okay, and I wanna help you understand the chemical process that will happen as we heat this up. So we have sucrose and we have a little bit of water, and as we heat it up, it's going to go through many chemical reactions, and I'm going to show you a few of the different compounds that it will make. But when people make candy, they have different stages. So we have thread stage, softball stage, firm ball, firm ball, hard ball, and then soft crack and hard crack, I think is what the rest of the stages are. And we're going to go all the way to that last stage, the hard crack stage. And what do you think is going to happen to the water it's as going we take this up? Evaporate and turn into steam. Right. Yeah, and some of it is going to stay water. Yes, but the stage we're going to, only 1% <coughs> of everything in the pot will be water. So we'll be very close to burning it, and we'll have to be so careful about that. Okay. But we're also going to have the sucrose is going to break apart into glucose and fructose. And then even these molecules will break, the bonds will break, and they'll reform into different structures with the carbon, oxygen, and hydrogen. Okay, and then we get all these different flavors and colors, and we get that thicker, sticky consistency all from these chemical changes. So, one of the first new compounds that will form will be like this. It's called diacetyl. I don't and have oxygen. This molecule is what adds like a buttery or butterscotch flavor, okay? And that happens early on. Then the, another one that we'll have, this is an ester called ethyl acetate, and it has like a fruity, sweet, or kind of like a rum flavor, the esters yeah. do. Okay, next, this is a furon, and it has more of a nutty flavor to it. And this is maltol, and it has a toasty flavor. So toasty. The, the more you 
cooking caramelized candy, the more richness you get in flavor as all of these start joining in, right? Okay, also, um, you'll get huge, huge molecules forming called caramelon, caramelin, and caramelin. Okay. Caramelon, caramelin, and caramelin. Yeah. <laughs> as they get bigger and bigger, that's how they change the name. Okay, and they just have tons of carbons, oxygens, and hydrogens. And the biggest one, the carbon, has 125 carbons, 188 hydrogens, and 80 oxygens. All right, so let's get measured up and start cooking. We already knew the basic ingredients because we read the book, but I found a recipe at littlehousebooks.com, and they might have other fun projects there too. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to measure a cup of brown sugar and a cup of molasses. And then we're going to heat them up together, get them all the way to hard crack stage. I'll, I'll do cookie. sugar. I'll do um, molasses. Okay. Sugar. I like that. I like this. Okay. <laughs> Parker's going to get the sugar. Sorry. Okay. It smells so good. Yeah, it already smells good, huh? It smells like... Oh, wow. That stuck. Okay. Now we gotta smash it and then the side, pack it in. Okay, now, dump it in. Dump it! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Oh, look at that thick, thick molasses. It's yeah, it's thick. It's so thick. Okay. Whoa! The molasses can be a little tricky oh. to stop pouring without making a mess. So Whoa. let's go I'll rinse the bottle. Okay, okay. and then I'll Perfect. pour it in. Hey, please, please put that down. What are you doing? Okay. Right there. What was it for? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I just want to lick it. So, we would need to get between 300 degrees Fahrenheit and 310 degrees Fahrenheit. Because we're at a higher elevation, we're going to shoot for 291 degrees uh -huh. up to 300, but let's, let's try to get it right close to the middle so we're not worried about burning. Yeah. And we're going to have to stir like crazy. Okay, okay. stir okay. Yeah. Can I start? Yay! Yeah. 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 Yay! Yay! Okay. Yay! Okay. It's the wood just grabbed you. No, can you tie this tighter? Yeah. I just feel like it's Well, he's on the bottom. Okay, let's go get right. snow. Take your pants out front. Okay, okay. Parker, it's slippery out there. You have to be so careful. Slow and careful on those stairs. Don't fall. That will ruin Ooh, the video. I see so much snow. Ah, cool. <gasps> right here. Yeah. yeah, over there. <gasps> Following steps behind Austin. <gasps> I think that that's good. Okay, I gotta go back. Parker, move. Let him fill up and then he'll fill up. <laughs> okay. <gasps> fill it up, Parker. Fill it up. Ooh, there we go. Now shake it flat. Not off. <laughs> flat. Hold on. Let me fill it up a little bit more. Ah, that's good. Okay, hold it. Can you walk? Come on, walk! Quick! Don't fall, don't fall, I'll help you. Okay, carry it up and put it up on the chair. We got our fresh snow. I can smell it. Yeah, me too. It smells pretty good. Me three. Let's see here, what's this look like? Mmm. The same. <laughs> yeah, this looks the same the whole time. You've been stirring like 10 minutes. Oh, right. oh it's bubbling. Ooh, ooh. I'm going to check its temperature while you keep, keep stirring. I'll see. Can I see? Keep stirring, Austin. I am. No, you're not stirring enough. You have to stir it all you the way stir around. stir the full bottom Scrape it. I it. I Even if you're scraping past. I want to stir it. Yeah, like Come on. You're going to have a turn. You'll have a turn. Ten the, minutes I don't want to hit the ruler. It's okay. It's a thermometer. Oh, yeah. Um, You can hit the thermometer. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> And walk out there into the clean spot. Look how much. That's probably good. Okay. 
Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it's like Looks like it's bubbling. Up, right? Yeah, it's bubbling. Temperature right. I on. can really smell it now. Yeah, me Smells too. Smells like molasses. Yeah. Hey Parker, yeah, you want to come over here and get a turn? So you have to stir the whole bottom part. Come faster. The whole bottom part has to be stirred. So it looks like, because this tells us what stages we're in, looks like we're close to softball stage. Faster, more. You have to stir, stir it. Whole stir it, stir it, stir it. But how do you know what temperature it is? The thermometer. Yeah. Tells you, you see the on the line. side. Blue line's going up. Zach, do you see on here how they have the stages written like softball right there? Uh huh. Hard ball, soft crack, hard crack. So, where is it? Is that softball? Yeah. It's uh, yeah. It's just getting to the softball stage. So softball means if you took a little bit and dripped it in ice cold water, it would form a soft ball. Uh, cool. And then there's firm ball and then there's hard ball would be like really hard. And then, I mean, I'm not, I get a little intimidated by this water testing method, but the hard crack is that if you drip some in like off a spoon into cold water, you might even hear like a cracking sound. Oh, that's because cool. Because it would go, you know, like, Get so hard and break. That's awesome. Oh, that's way so, easier, Mister. Yeah. Oh, you can feel it feeling thick. different, huh? Yeah. Mm. Before it was like really thick, but now it's thinner, more air and bubbly. And stuff. So it's about. Ooh, it's getting thicker. Like around 200. Yeah. I mean, it's getting degrees. darker. Oh. It's interesting because I've noticed the few times I've made candy that if I watch the temperature a lot. It'll move fast and then it'll stay in one place for a while. And then it'll move fast again. And then it'll like stay in one place for a while. And I think it does that every time there's a new chemical change and it's switching to like a new stage of and a new hardness of candy, you know? Um, so it's been really, a, it was like stuck near the softball temperature for a while and then it started moving faster again. So it's been right around 265 degrees for a while, Austin. Yeah. And I'm thinking because that it might be moving into soft crack stage right now because I can see where soft crack stage is at sea level. It smells different. It smells, it smells different. more toasted. Uh, more toasty, yeah. And it, it foams differently. I can't ever describe it, but I always love watching the change when I do this. Me too. Right? Let's see. Oh yeah. <clears throat> Ooh, we're getting close to the temperature we're going for, Parker. What is the temperature now? It's um 284. No, it's 103. <laughs> Not even close, chump dog. <laughs> it looks different, right? Uh huh. Is that Ooh. on? Yeah, it's okay. on. Okay, so um, it's a little hard to see because we have a foggy candy thermometer, um. but. Um, it looks like, because it was right around 290 for a while, and I think it's just moving past it, but I'm just going to make sure. Should I go get the snow now? Yeah, go ahead and get the snow. Okay. And we'll just do a little bit more stirring. Alright. It is ready. So we each need a spoon, and then what they said in the book was that the girls made circles and curly cues and squiggles and stuff like that. I think it's mostly just going to be like dropping it on the snow. But um, we're going to do it. It's super hot. Yeah. Yeah. Can we're going to do the first one. Like this. Well, yeah. Can we do the first one. We're going to do this. So we're going to get this. <laughs> and then we're going to do this. Look how Parker. Look how it's like melting into the snow. That is super okay, hot. Okay. And then we're going to like dig it out of the snow and eat yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. So drizzle it on. Try your not snow, to guys. fling it on the floor. Okay, I'll go first. You Wait, can stick your spoons in. All right. Careful not to burn each other, too. Ooh, that's dangerous. It's so hot. I might get more snow. <laughs> it's just melting right through it. Yeah. That's interesting. You gotta get a top view. Why exactly do we need the snow again? Cools it off, makes it into hard candy. 
stuck oh, to and it, yeah, it's not stuck to any. It's not stuck to the metal. Oh. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> Zach, I'm gonna add some snow for you. Parker's doing great. Mm -hmm. I'm snowing it out. Okay. Cool. I'm gonna go get more. Yeah. Awesome, Parker. So you're gonna dig it out of the snow. You're gonna dig it out of the snow. Awesome. <laughs> you're gonna dig it out of the snow. This is interesting. I've never done anything like this before. Yeah, yeah. me neither. Very interesting. Me either. I'm very glad we read Little House in the Big Woods. I couldn't quite picture it when she was telling us about it in Little House uh -huh. book. But uh. now it makes more sense. Wow, look at that mound of look at this stuff. Is like super pretty. Look at mine, it's like it. wet. Pretty this smart using the snow because then it's not stuck to the metal and it's in all these really cool shapes when it's cooling. Yeah. Ooh, look at that. Wait, the snow's gonna go away? I mean, it's gonna you be want, like, you ate some? I heard somebody crunching on some. <laughs> Wait, it, it looks so it pretty the way the light reflects off of it. It's like, Whoa. It's like really pretty hair or something. Look, look at that. Look at that. Oh I just pulled it out. I like hardened onto uh -huh. the snow. So cool. Oh, yeah. Oof, I'm thirsty from just taking a small crunch. Mm -hmm. oh, it's look so at beautiful. yours. Can you guys see how beautiful this is? Wet. Cannot get over Wait, that. Wait, so all the snow is going to like melt and be gone and it's going to be like a cool structure? Uh, if you want to wait till tomorrow. Alright, let's get this wire. Whoa. Whoa! Hold it up to the camera closer. Hold it still up to the camera. Oh, yeah, look at that. Now turn it around. Yeah. It's so weird. I like to eat it with the snow so it's not so strong. Mm -hmm. mm. It's like having it with water. Can I put it on the table? Sounds very crunchy. Oh, yeah. It's like eating really hard. We put crunch. this at hard crack, so it's definitely crunchy. See? Oh, yeah, it's hard. It's super hard. Oh, wow. Whoa! Oh, it's like roots. Oh, guys, yeah, look at this it's piece. like roots. Sit down. This is the most interesting piece. Let's see if I can get it off. Whoa! Nice. And it's good for your teeth. <laughs> uh, what? Yeah. Mom, you have to try the snow. Only the snow. Mmm. <laughs> no? It's crunchy. Hey, Parker. Oh, there you go. You're using that piece as a spoon to scoop the snow. <laughs> Take as big of a bite of the snow as you can. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what time it is now? Time for dinner. <laughs> nice and full, right? Wow, wow, yep. wow, wow, if we were in a little house, what would we eat for dinner? Um, pie. What? Like venison? Cereal. Yeah, like venison. Maybe pie. What's not a holiday? Head cheese. Head uh -huh. cheese, yeah. That's my favorite. <laughs> Head cheese? Doesn't sound that good. Why? Get it out. <laughs> <laughs> She's losing it. <laughs>